What kind of drinks made easy? Most people like apple cider, and everyone knows that fresh is best. But a lot of folks don't make cider at home because they think it's either too time consuming or too difficult. So, we have a super easy homemade apple cider recipe for you. And best of all, once you're done with the apples, you can make an excellent applesauce with it. To build your homemade apple cider, you'll start with 10 cored and cut apples. Now, if you get one of these guys, it makes the work a lot easier going, so we highly recommend it. Next, you'll add 3 quarters of a cup of sugar, 1 tablespoon of ground allspice, and 1 tablespoon of ground cinnamon. Add water until you've covered all of the apples. But be sure not to overfill the pot because you are going to have some expansion and obviously bubbles as you boil this. And if you fill it up too much, it's gonna boil over and create a big old mess. Turn on the heat to high. And you're gonna boil this uncovered for one hour. However, once you get to a boil, turn the heat down a little bit so you still maintain a boil but don't have a rolling boil. Otherwise, you'll have massive evaporation. And when you're done, just use a colander to separate out the cider from the apples. I do recommend using a vessel that's larger than you need because if it's uh, if you don't have a little bit of wiggle room, there can be a fair bit of splashing and then you're just creating a mess all over your workspace. So that's it. Yeah, it takes about an hour, but this is as easy as it gets for a really nice homemade apple cider. Or you could buy that store-bought crap if you want to be a garbage person. But you do you. Cheers from Drinks Made Easy. Straight hot garbage. Straight hot garbage. Please be sure to like, subscribe, and click on the bell icon to be notified anytime we release a new video. And if you have any suggestions or recipes you'd like to see on the show, please leave them in the comments. Cheers.